And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It is Bayern Munich facing Barcelona. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. the initial 11 for Bayern. Manuel Neuer begins in goal. Niklas Zule starts alongside Lucas Hernandez in central defence. Serge Gnabry starts with Kingsley Coman out wide and getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. This is what we think for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Frankie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. We're about to find out who will be crowned club kings of Europe. Well, he did everything right there, barring a couple of inches. He's a bit unfortunate, really. Attacker like that in the initial phase of the game, attracting the interest of the referee. So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there he's not going to take any messing about here. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And Torres on the ball. Must be! Oh, marvellous save! Great goalkeeping. Sergio Busquets. Great opportunity! Oh, that is a superb save! Well, so close to seeing an early goal here. It's a great save, you have to say. And Bayern Munich now in potentially a dangerous position. Well, no luck keeping possession. And the pass could do damage. Supporters. 
just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. has restarted, 1-0 here. Sergio Busquets. PK. Well, the timing was perfect, ball one. Can he find the net? And that's a very good parry. Well, that save has kept them in this game. They now need to create one or two chances of their own. Coman. Now with Lewandowski. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. Here, Emerick Aubameyang. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Coman. This is Robert Lewandowski. Alfonso Davies. Bayern pushing forward with options available. Oh, great attacking play. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Safe pair of hands, did his job. And all the way through it goes to the goalkeeper. Well, those stats tell you everything. Bayern have enjoyed the majority of possession and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that. Given away by Bayern Munich. How about the cross? Sergio Busquets. Obama Yang making sure it didn't get past him. Well, offside anyway, albeit a tight one. Ferran Torres. Chance to cross. It's a corner. And there's the delivery. Now the keeper grabs it. Obama Yang able to get a body in the way. A chance to eat into their lead. What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Thomas Müller. And the counter looks on here, options available. An alert intervention. Oh, lovely weighted ball, they might be in. Wasted chance, easy for the goalkeeper. 
Alfonso Davies. It's with Kingsley Coman. Great effort to keep that one in play. Kimmich. And he read it well. Frankie de Jong. Now with Aubameyang. De Jong. Torres. This looks promising out wide. Well, just one minute of time. And still a chance. And thumped away. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at the home of Tottenham. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Sergio Busquets. Pedri. And Obama Young saw his pass gobbled up. Goretzka. And a good tackle. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Might be dangerous. And unfortunately for him, he had worked his way into an offside position. And I think everybody in the ground could see that was always going to be offside. Joshua Kimmich. Serge Gnabry. Kimmich. And return to Muna. Well, they no longer have the ball. Ferran Torres. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Delivering it into the box. A decisive clearance it was. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Lewandowski. And here's Joshua Kimi. And that will be a corner. And Bayern will change personnel now. Number 11, Kingsley Coleman, to be replaced by number 10, Leroy Sane. So the corner played into the box. Well, not quite the ideal delivery. No nonsense clearance. Pedri. And breaking at pace with Menace. Frankie de Jong. And he might be through here. Not denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. Obama Yang. Tremendous ball played through. Well, there is a very alert goalkeeper for you. 
Leroy Zane. Müller. Lewandowski now. Thomas Müller. Gnabry. What's he going to do here? Müller. Kimmich. Here's Zane. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Just 20 minutes remaining now. And that is how to block. Joshua Kimmich. Gnabry with it. Kimmich. And Bayern moving the ball with purpose. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Giving the ball away. Serge Gnabry. This is Robert Lewandowski. Very difficult challenge to perform, but he succeeded. Barcelona have given us away. Well, nearing the end of this contest, and Bayern in cruise control, Stuart. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play, and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. Time for the change now. Number 19, Ferran Torres, to be replaced by number 11, Adama Traore. Adama, bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. Adama. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Marvellous anticipation. Leon Goretzka. Lewandowski. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Obama Yang. Big chance. And there it is. All in the melting pot now. And what a finale we could have in store for us. Well, here's the replay. And what a well delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed. And the finish is really well taken. Because he judges the flight of the ball, uses the right technique, and then makes such good contact. That's a clever goal. with the match 2-1 is the scoreline what's going to happen next 
And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Leon Goretzka. Pass after pass, happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents. Really good attacking play. Determined block. And it's all over now. A Champions League success story for Bayern Munich. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. Look, we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Bayern Munich. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.